I do for you, Professor? I want your newspaper to expose Professor Endeavor for the sham he is and get him out of my science academy. Just look at this nonsense he's teaching the kids. Yes. 7B, close bracket? It doesn't make any sense. No, it says cat upside down, you bloody idiot. Oh. But there's no such thing as cats. Yes, Everybody but, knows Yes, this. but I can't send one of my reporters on an expedition. It's suicide. But do you? Have a reporter that could be that incredibly stupid. Hmm? Ah. Hey, are my ears burning because I'm bleeding a lot? Happy banana day! Happy banana day. How's the opera singing coming along, Steve? Oh, 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 oh. Ah. Oh, 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 oh my god! It's okay! I landed on the glass! <sighs> you called for me, sir? No. Oh, um, oh, okay, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll just go. Wait, no. Come in, come in. I have an assignment just for you. An assignment? F for me? Wow, you haven't given me an assignment since that one time I accidentally ate an orphan. Yes, but never mind all that. We want you to join Professor Endeavor on his expedition to find the really big cat. Oh, wow. What a scoop. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. I'll sign up right now. Oh, boy, oh, boy. I'm going to grab my swimming trunks. Whoa. Okay. I landed on my face. Is he the stupid one? Yes. yes, yes, I knew that. This Science Academy celebrates all schools of thought. So, without bias, let me introduce the giant piece of shit! That is Professor Endeavor. Sorry, sorry, excuse me, sorry. You may not believe in cats, but I will find it. So who here is brave enough to join my expedition? Oh, no, no, I've got a note from Mummy and I'm dead. Ahem. Hmm? I know you're full of shit, but I want to see for myself. Yes, I will come. Thank you, Sir Grumbles. Thank you. Um, excuse me, Harry Beardy, Angry Man. Hmm? Yes, I, I would like to come to the expedition, please. Bitch, you wouldn't last one day. You'll get a spider lay its eggs in your eye socket, and it'll be wah wah. I want to go home. Oh, that's okay. I don't have a home. I just live in a hole in the ground with a family of very patient badgers. But I'll guess I'll keep you for bait. My mum said the same thing when I was born. What is your occupation? Oh yes, um, I'm a reporter sent here to completely discredit you and to end your career. <coughs> kill him! Kill the bastard! Insert a turtle into his urethra! Stab his grandmother right in front of him while he tries to eat his supper! Just rip off his arm and then beat him up with it and then put it back on and beat him with the other! I need the professor to talk to me. Okay, I'll take a small stone and I'll throw it gently at his window. And <laughs> what could possibly go? Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it, I forgot to let go of the stone. Okay, wait, wait, look, I'm, I'm sorry that I lied. I'm sorry I broke your window. And I'm sorry for saying that you're so hairy that it looks like your face is being born. And I'm sorry for setting fire to your dog outside. I, I don't even know if you own a dog, but there's a dog outside and it's on fire and I'm sorry. And I'm sorry to- Oh, Colonel! Oh, 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 Roly-poly fighting style! Roly-poly! 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 Frost! Frost! Roly-poly! Why? I'm in the shape of a Y. Why? All right, all right, break it up, break it up! He started it, he attacked me with some weird roly-poly thing, and I think I might be pregnant. Do you want him arrested? <sighs> no, it was my fault. Thank you, officer. Fine, back to the fly dog! Hey, boy! Where are you going, you bleed my- Wait, look, I know how it feels to be not taken seriously, but I promise you, when, not if, when we find the really big cat, we'll put it on the front page, found by Professor Endeavor. Uh, the, the, the cat, I mean, not the front page. So, what do you say? I'll teach you how to roly-poly. Uh, okay. Step one, always keep your fires lubricated. Pointy sticks for sale. Do you want a pointy stick? No, we don't. Go away. They always target the tourists. Oh, I want a pointy stick. No, you don't. 
We're three weeks into our expedition right now and still no sign of any cat. And we're running low on everything. Patience, morale, Marmite. I just really hope we see a really big cat soon. For Professor Endeavor's sake, and mine. Here, all this reminds me of a movie. Do you know which one? Uh, Kong Pao? No. Dead Men Don't Wear Plaid? No, not that one. Uh, Power Rangers? The Lost World. The 1925 silent film with the Jurassic Park sequel. The first one. Oh, yeah, that's the one with the blackface, isn't it? Yeah, that's the one. Oh, you couldn't do that today. Yeah, of course, if we have blackface, we'd have to find some way to cut it out of the film real seamlessly. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> Who's that with Sir Grumbles? She's the most beautiful only female character I've ever seen. I'll put my money on the brown one. The brown one? Yeah, 20 pounds. Okay. Panther. Hokey dokey. Time to get out my charm and hope she doesn't laugh at it. Hey, how's it going? Uh, are you an angel? Because I'm suffering from malnutrition and I might be dying. Just leave me alone. Okay, how about I just say a bunch of random words and maybe one of them will spark a topic of conversation? Uh, let's see, uh, tuna, salmon, goldfish, clownfish, trout, sea bass, sardine. I can only think of fish, I don't know why. Um, cod. Stop talking! Ow, my white and I'm so dead. My word, it's the scientific discovery of the century. Shoot it, shoot it in the face! What did you do? Well, I was so startled that I farted, and I think I shat myself, but I'm too scared to check, so it's kind of a Schrodinger's pants situation right now, and- SHUT UP! Look! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. there! What the- huh? Whoa. Mm -hmm. It's the cat! Mm. Professor, you found the really big cat! Let's go home and tell the world! Yes, but not without that cat! Alive! <laughs> I did- uh, sorry, I didn't catch that. What did you say? ALIVE! Ah, oh, oh, right. Guys, help, my face is frozen. Oh, hey guys. <laughs> Paula? Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Just don't look down. Okay. Don't look down? Why, what's down there? Oh my God, we're so high up. Paula, are you looking at this? It's like looking for the wrong end of a telescope. Oh, Paula, can you imagine falling down there? I mean, the velocity alone would probably just snap your spine in half, and that's even before you land on all those jagged rocks and thorn bushes. <gasps> oh my god, Paula, there's even a bunch of bears down there standing round a cooking pot. I thought that only happened in cartoons. Oh, come on, Paula, you gotta look down. Look down, Paula. Look down, Paula. Paula, look down. Paula, look down. Paula, look. Oh, you're here. Hello. But there really is something down there. Really? I want to look. <laughs> Shit! Oh my god, you have amazing eyesight! Thank you! So Grumbles is exploring the rest of this cave, and Professor Endeavor's outside having a fight with a tree. I'll kill you, you bastard tree! And oh, you're a worthy opponent! So that means we're all alone. Oh, Paula, when I first laid my eyes on you, I thought, Ow, my eyes, they're out of my face, why? And they're still on their veiny stems, draped all over your body. Oh my god, that's so disgusting, I'm sorry, <laughs> but... But during that time, I, I realized I cared deeply about you, and I wondered if you'd do me the honor of spending time with me. You know, voluntarily. No! No. I can't. Oh. R right. Um, of course. Um, I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have been so forward. Um, I I'm, I'm gonna go. It's very, it's very dusty in here, isn't it? I'm getting dust in my sadness. <laughs> I'm not crying. This is dusty sadness. <laughs> it's so dusty. <laughs> I know you like him, Paula, but he can't know about your secret. Never. Never.
No, don't cry. You you know you don't know how to cry. Oh no, no Paula, no. Oh, you just look sick. You're so bad at crying. That's like four out of ten tops. Oh, I'm such an idiot. To think that someone like me, just a clumsy reporter, would have a chance. Oh, Professor, have you ever been in love? Not now, you idiot. We got trouble. Hmm? Okay, I think it's gone. Oh no, it's there! Oh, hey guys! Oh, wait, my, my brain is doing that thing where it kind of hurts, but in a good way. Yes, I've got an idea! You've got an idea? Yeah! Oh, shit. All right, cat, you're going down. Roly poly style! Meow? Roly poly, roly poly, roly poly, thrust, thrust, roly poly! Of course, I landed on my bones. Oh, and more thankfully, the cat is alive! Maybe we should leave it here and go home. Mm. Not without that cat! Right. Mm. Very well. Is everyone okay? We caught the cat! Oh, no, I want to tell her! We the cat! Shut up! Yeah, so, uh, you must be pretty impressed, eh? <laughs> yeah, you're impressed. When I left for my expedition, you all laughed at me. But I have returned with a cat. It has a fluffy face and fluffy ears. So, who is laughing now? <laughs> so the exhibition for the cat will be going live shortly. We've just put the cat into an inescapable cage that is so very inescapable that nothing can escape it. Not even the person who built it. Right, excuse me. I have to take this phone call. I'm sure it's good news. Yes? Good news! You're due a refund on that inescapable cage. What happened? See, that's the bad news. Um, the, the cat escaped and is now running rampant in London. Do you want me to sort out that refund now or later? Later? I think later. The cat's out the bag! Please! There is no need to riot! riot. No! Wait! I will recapture it! I promise! I've got the chair! No, you run out of money! Hey, what's it? Oh, hey guys! <laughs> Thank God I found you. We'd better find somewhere to hide. I suggest the Italian restaurant down the road. Uh, table for two, seven o'clock. There's something I have to tell you. <sighs> Paula? I am a cat. What? Only I can defeat Mother. What? Paula, you must fulfill your destiny. Yes, Father. 